Just about an hour, the Youngsville City Council will discuss the potential widening of Bonan Road. They'll look at costs of construction for an overlay and widening project. Abby Breinbach has why one neighbor is looking for a solution but isn't sure this is the right one. About, about four to five times a week we travel on Bonan Road. Kathleen Howard knows if she's going to travel that two-lane road just blocks from her house, there are only certain times each day that it's bearable. The mornings and in the middle of the day, um, well, before lunchtime. Lafayette's a lunch town, I find, so lunchtime is it's, it's hectic, and especially right when people are trying to get home from work or when they're getting their kids from school, it's an additional 15 minutes. So she finds ways around driving on Bonan at these hours. We plan our trips to the grocery or wherever we're going around avoiding that time of day. But for drivers who have less flexible schedules or just get stuck at an unlucky time, what should be quick trips become long and messy. Traffic at this four-way stop just lines up forever and ever and ever. And then you have people who don't know how to use a four-way stop and they're waiting for somebody to tell them to go. So it's, um, it's quite an inconvenience at that time. Which is why the council is talking about widening the road. Though the end result is desirable, Howard has questions about what traffic will look like in the meantime. I'm concerned about the inconvenience of the widening of the road because it's a road that's necessary for us to get around right now, but something needs to be done. That's something now up for discussion by the City Council. In Youngsville, Abby Breidenbach, KATC TV3.